y'all, it's Heather, and it is almost time for Nordstrom's biggest sale of the year, their anniversary sale, and I want to talk about all the beauty deals. I absolutely love talking about makeup always, but the cool thing about the Nordstrom anniversary sale is they will have new products on sale. Things that are on sale just for this anniversary sale and then they will go back up to full price once the sale is over. I always like to see what type of sets and things will be coming out, if there's any new exclusive things. So we're going to go through the things that I think are noteworthy. We'll talk about hair care, fragrance, makeup, of course, skincare. I just, I want to let y'all know like my reviews on some of these products, what I think I may buy, what I'm not planning to buy, all of that. Let me quickly run through the sale dates with you. I will also have them all in the description box and I'll have links to everything there as well. I know that Nordstrom does sell out of these like hot exclusive items a lot of the times. I do want to go ahead and get this video up to y'all early so that if there's anything you had your eye on you could kind of bookmark it or make a note for later. Let's start off with this duo from YSL. We'll start on a positive note today because I love this formula from YSL. Their lip products are so luxurious. This is a Love Shine lip oil stick duo and the value of these is $90 and it's gonna be at the sale for $60. Each of these normally run $45. If you go look at one of these shades at Sephora right now, they're $45. $30 off is a pretty big discount. Now I won't be shopping this because I actually have both of these shades already. So let me show you these on my lips in case you're curious about this set. In the set we have the shade 44 Nude. This is really beautiful and these lipsticks are super like hydrating and very comfortable on the lips. It's a very sheer but buildable type of formula. And the other shade in here is shade 150 Nude Lingerie. Both of these shades are very beautiful, very comfortable, and the packaging is way and heavy like it feels like a luxury lipstick I enjoy like you've seen me talk about these YSL lipsticks I've taken them traveling with me I really enjoy them and I think this is a great price if you were looking at these shades of course the set is only a value to you if it's something you want a shade you want but I think this is really nice and it comes in this really beautiful box set so if you wanted to get it as like a gift I think that would be really nice too and that's something that I like about the sale because a lot of these things are kind of like sets so they're very giftable and luxurious feeling in that way and it's something, it's something I appreciate. We'll also talk about this mascara duo from MAC. This is the MAC Stack Mascara, and it's gonna be $20 off, which is a great price point, but for me, I would not recommend this. I tried this mascara when it first launched, and I just don't like it. I don't think it did enough for my lashes. Now, I'm kind of picky when it comes to mascaras. I want them to give me length and volume. Like, I want them to do it all, not smudge, all of that. And this mascara just didn't do much for me. So if you're looking to pick up a mascara in the sale, this is one that I would skip over. Let's talk about this Ambient Rose face palette from Hourglass. Hourglass loves putting out these palettes with existing shades from their line. And what I always recommend is checking your collection of Hourglass powders and seeing do you already have any of these shades? Because if you do, then it's probably not worth the price. So one of the shades in this quad I do already have in my ambient lighting edit unlocked tiger palette and i am wearing the blush today this is the blush in iridescent rose it's a really pretty warm blushed rose type of color but i don't need two of them and because only three of these shades would be new to my collection i'm gonna pass on this if you don't have any of these shades and you think these are powders that you would really like really enjoy really get a good use out of I think it's a nice palette. I mean, it's gonna be $64. I think it's a good deal. But again, only if these are shades that you don't have and will use. Benefit is gonna be offering a mini mascara set, three different mascaras for $48. And the sale price is going to be 30 making these $10 a piece. And while I don't think that's a 
terrible deal. I don't think it's a good deal either because so many times we see places like Ulta who do carry benefit running these mini mascaras like buy one get one free, buy two get one free on like half off, something like that. So for me this is not an item that is like oh wow I can't believe that's on sale let me grab it. It's an item that goes on sale pretty often. I understand that these three being in a set at this price point is like an exclusive but overall I, I don't think this is a great deal. I am considering buying this set from Moroccan Oil. This is the Treatment Home and Away set. $74 value for $50. I love the Moroccan oil and I have not had it in a long time. Hair oil takes me so long to use up, but this is an oil that I really, really enjoy and I'm actually almost done with my current hair oil from Kerastase. I really love that one too, but I'm thinking that while this one is on sale, it could be a great time to pick it up, plus you get a mini. I appreciate minis because I do travel and I don't like to pack like a check bag. I always like to pack carry-on. So having a mini is important to me and I, I think I'm going to buy this one. I think I would get a lot of use out of it. Let me know your favorite hair oil if you use a hair oil because I'm always like looking for hair recommendations and this one this one I think I may buy. Let's talk about these lip kits from MAC. This is the Pout Full of Posies lip kit. This is a $73 value for $45. You get a lip pencil, a lipstick, and a gloss. I think that's a great price. I mean, I enjoy MAC lip products. I actually pulled out my lip liners to see which of these shades do I already have? Like, do I need any of these? There are gonna be three different sets. Ruby Woo, Velvet Teddy, and Soar. The only lip liner that I have that are in these sets is Ruby Woo, and Ruby Woo is an iconic MAC color. Like, MAC, the thing about their lip liners, of course they have a great formula. They're not too dry, they don't tug on your lips, they're pigmented all of that but they have so many different shades and that's why I shop MAC lip liners so much but Ruby Woo is definitely beautiful and then for Velvet Teddy I have the lipstick it is what I'm wearing today I'm wearing it over a lip like balm because I didn't want it to be too matte today but Velvet Teddy I have this shade but not in the formula that's going to be coming in the Nordstrom set so here's the color right here if you want to see it just swatched on my hand but it's, I mean, I obviously love MAC lip liners. I, I think I used to have Soar. I just cannot find it, or maybe it's somewhere in my lip liners and I'm not seeing it. But I think this is a great deal if you like these colors. I like that they're giving the lipstick, the gloss, and the lip liner all in a set. I think that makes it really nice and easy. So if any of these appeal to you, I would definitely recommend. I am considering picking up this Charlotte Tilbury Duo of setting sprays. I really love this setting spray from Charlotte Tilbury. I actually bought one and used it up completely and I haven't repurchased yet because I'm like it's expensive and I have setting sprays I need to use but I love this one. So if I can get the duo for $76 normal price on sale for $56 I may pick this up too. I saw this bag go viral on TikTok and it is going to be on sale. It's normally $95 and it's going to be on sale for $70.99. So like $19 and one penny <laughs> on sale. If you were interested in this, FYI, it's going to be on sale. It's not for me. It's not like my personal style aesthetic but I did want to let you know in case that's a bag that you've had on your wish list. It is a makeup bag, like a cosmetics bag, but on TikTok people seem to be like carrying it as a purse and things like that. So again, just want to let you know. This I think is an amazing deal from Sigma. I love Sigma brushes and they are going to have their soft coverage brush set that are $71 if you bought them separately for $45. And if you've been here at my channel for the past few months, you know I love these brushes. These launched just a few months ago. I believe they launched in April. And I love Sigma. Hello, I love Sigma. I have a favorites brush set with Sigma. And when I got these brushes from them, I immediately fell in love. If you were planning to shop the sale and you want to try these brushes, I think getting them in this set is so, so great. So I did use these brushes to get ready today. I used these brushes to get ready like 
all the time and I just love them so much. I think the shapes are so, so nice. I love the foundation brush, the concealer brush, and I love the like bronzer brush. You can use these for so many different things. You'll see coming up, I used the foundation brush for blush today as well. Like they're really multifunctional and they're such good quality. I've bought so many Sigma brushes over the years. I can't even tell you like so many and the quality is so, so good. They also make really interesting shapes. That's why I love like this bronzer brush is what I use for bronzer at least is so good. The F11, like I just love it. I cannot say enough good things about the YSL Lash Clash Mascara. I love it. If you are a subscriber of mine and you watch all my videos, you are probably like, girl, stop with the YSL mascara. We know you love it. We get it. We got the memo the 100th time you sent it. Like we get it. But I'm telling y'all, I love this mascara. Of course, I love the waterproof, but I want to show you what the brown looks like on because this is one that I think was unexpected for me. I mean, I know brown mascaras have a place, but I'm always just like, no, I want drama. I want the black mascara. I want to go as black as I can. And I was pleasantly surprised when I tried the brown mascara, just how like fun and light and kind of different it looks in a subtle way. So it's not that thing in your look that's going to make you like, wow, you really change things up, but it's going to be that subtle difference. Like, huh, so, something's different and it's pretty. So I'm really loving the brown mascara, but they are gonna have a duo with the black as well, and I am wearing the black today. So it is gonna be a duo of the same color, but I do go through mascaras, and this is a mascara that does it all for me. This is my a mascara that I just love, and it gives me that length, volume, it doesn't fade, it doesn't flake, all of that for me, it holds curl well, I love it. So I don't think it's bad to get two of the same because it's actually a product that I would use up. And it's going to be a $58 value for $43. And I feel like that's a, a pretty good deal. Let's talk about this discovery set from Lilabo because I'm considering purchasing this. I would like to try these scents from the brand. This is going to be a $99 value on sale for $67. So you get mini perfumes or mini fragrances. And I'm intrigued by these. So 13 says it's a unisex scent, which I love. I love kind of a traditionally masculine scent. Like give it to me. I love that. And this one says it's musk, woody amber, moss seeds. I'm into that. 31 is lavender, but it says it knocks lavender on its head. I don't know what that means, but I'm intrigued. And 33 Santal has been on my wish list for a long time now. It says it is a woody fragrance. And I, I really think I'm going to try these. They are minis, but I also like fragrance minis, especially if it's a scent that I haven't had before. I don't know I'm going to love. I haven't tried it because spraying a scent and then wearing a scent can be totally different experiences. So I am considering picking that one up. Let's talk about this duo from NARS because it is a $68 value for $40, which I think is a good deal. And there's two different shades of blush in here. So you have their iconic shade and one of their more shimmery shades, and it is full sized and it's in their new improved updated formula. So I do have this shade right here. It's the more matte shade. I will show you this on my cheeks so that you can see how it applies because I use this all the time. And if it weren't for me already having one of these, I would have purchased this because I do think getting two full size NARS blushes for $20 a piece is a great price. And I think these shades are beautiful. I do think that they look good on everyone. Let's talk about this lip set from Charlotte Tilbury. So this is a pillow talk lip set. You get the matte liquid lipstick, the lip cheek liner, and the matte revolution lipstick. So the airbrush and the matte. So a liquid lipstick and a bullet lipstick and a lip liner. Now the only item I have in this set is the lip liner and I am wearing it today. I wanted to show you some of these products in case you were curious and you just are like, oh, I kind of want to see them on 
and I think this is a nice set. I have never tried her liquid lipstick formula though, so I cannot speak to that. And I do really like her matte revolution lipstick, but because I already have the lip liner, it's not a good value for me, so I'm gonna pass on it. But if you've never tried Charlotte Tilbury lip products and you wanted to try her iconic shade Pillow Talk, I think this would be a good set. This Byredo mini set is $104 value and it's going to be on sale for $95. So there's three different mini fragrances in here and I was very curious about Mojave Ghost. So I was actually looking at this set thinking, okay, I think I might buy that. But this is only going to be $9 discount and I don't really think that's an amazing discount. I think more so why this is here and why it's on sale is because it's an exclusive set which I think it's not bad but I also saw that this set the perfumes don't come with little spritz spritzers. They call it uh, something else not spritzer autom automizers. So to me, that makes them not quite as easy to use. I do like to spray a perfume. I don't mind using my fingers sometimes, but if I'm going to pay $100, I'd rather have that. So I think I'm going to skip this one. The Mediterranean Glow Set is an $81 value from Giorgio Armani, and it's going to be on sale for $54. I feel that that's a pretty good discount, and it's going to be two of their like best selling products. So I have never tried these. I would love to hear if you have because I could be persuaded to buy this and I need to know, like, should I shop it? I don't know. You get the Luminous Silk Blush in the shade 50 and then a Fluid Sheer Glow Enhancer in Golden Bronze. So I'm intrigued. I don't have these products from Armani. So let me know should I shop or should I skip them? Another Charlotte Tilbury set. I have to say Charlotte Tilbury is putting out some pretty good sets if you're interested in the brand and don't have these products. This is a $88 price point, but the regular price is $132. And this one, you get the Beauty Blush Wand and Pillow Talk, the matte, and then you get the powder highlighter and pillow talk. I have heard nothing but good things about these and I don't know why I haven't bought one myself. Like I'm so tempted because everybody who tries these seems to really love this formula, but I am not getting this set because I already have the Pink Gasm Beauty Light Wand. I am wearing this today underneath that hourglass blush. So I wanna show you what it looks like on my face how easy it blends. I blend it in with my Sigma brush. I can use my fingers, a sponge. It doesn't matter. This is beautiful. And I have tons of the Beauty Light Wands from Charlotte Tilbury. Like I can't help myself buying these. I think it's such a great formula. So if you are interested in these shades, you don't already have these in your collection, like Charlotte Tilbury, like her cheek products are just a must have for me. I think she makes such good complexion products. Let's talk about the avocado eye cream from Kiehl's because I, in my younger years, was not a believer in eye cream, but now I am wiser at 36 years old and I love an eye cream. This one from Kiehl's is so soothing, so beautiful, so wonderful. And I think this duo is at a good, good price point. So this is $97 worth of the Kiehl's eye cream on sale for $65, which you may be thinking, I don't need two eye creams. And definitely, I'm not telling you you need anything, but I'm saying I will be using this up. Now, I've been using this for a couple of months now, and a little goes a long way. I'm trying to see, like, can you see how much of that I have used? It's, it's a pretty good amount. I use this every single night and sometimes during the day. It just depends, but I definitely love using this at night. I feel like it just gives me hydration to my eyes, but it doesn't feel heavy. You know, sometimes, or maybe I don't, but for me, sometimes I can put on an eye cream and I feel it all night. Even an hour later, I'm like, my eyes like they feel heavy it's just too much this I feel it sinks into the skin but 
doesn't go away. So it sinks in, but I can still feel like I'm hydrated without feeling heavy and I definitely not dry or anything like that. So I really, really, really enjoy this. And the other thing that I like about this is there is a claim that it doesn't migrate into the eyes. And I definitely agree with that. When I put it on, I don't feel like it moves around and ends up getting in my eyes to where it's like irritating my actual eyeball. <laughs> it stays where I put it and moisturizes. Let's talk about the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. This is $68 regular price $105 and I use this whenever my skin really needs that drink of hydration really needs that moisture I feel like this is kind of a classic product can you see how much I've used of this I've been using this for a few months now too and I use this probably one to two times a week as my nighttime moisturizer. I know so many people love it for during the day. My husband will use this during the day. He has dry skin. Me with my oily skin, I prefer it at night. Not because it's heavy, but because it's so moisturizing that if I've been in the sun, something like that, and I'm like, oh, I really need to baby my skin. I really like this cream for that. It also has ceramides in the formula, and my skin loves ceramides when it needs to be like nourished and hydrated and babied. So that for me is definitely must have. Another Kiehl's product that I really enjoy is the Retinol Skin Renewing Daily Microdose Serum with daily strength concentrates of retinol, peptide, and ceramides. So I like to use this usually once or twice a week too when my skin maybe is acting up. I have a little breakout, something like that. I like to reach for this because it will give me that kind of like resurfacing thing that I need while also having the ceramides to help not irritate my skin. So I, I really enjoy this. I think this one is really nice. It's a $92 value. It's a bigger size than this one that I have, but it's going to be on sale for $59. So that from Kiehl's is a must have for me. This Prada Lipstick Clutch gift set, it's $250 regular price. It's gonna be on sale for $190. And I am actively talking myself out of this because I do not need this but I want this, so I don't even know what to say about it. I just, there's something so luxurious and so giftable about this. And I'm telling myself this does not need to be a gift from me to me because I'm totally wanting to do that. And you know, like y'all aren't gonna judge me, right? If I end up coming home with this later, right, right, right? We're all friends here. But this set looks so beautiful. These lip colors look so beautiful. You get one of the refillable lipstick cases and four matte finish lipsticks in this triangle Prada clutch. And I'm sorry, it just looks so pretty, but please tell me I don't need it. MAC is releasing a mini brush set. This is the mini brush bouquet set, and it's going to be $55. I would say skip this, although I have not tried this set in particular. Whenever I bought mini brush sets like this from MAC, the quality is never the quality of the regular MAC brushes, like the MAC Pro brushes that are always in their line with the black uh, handle and the silver ferrule. The brushes that come out in these sets, I have bought a couple over the years and I'm not saying they're bad brushes at all like I still have some in my collection but they're not the brushes I reach for and they're definitely not the quality that I expect from MAC so if you're looking at this set and you're kind of debating I would say skip it another thing to kind of convince me to buy the set from Moroccan oil is that there is gift with purchase and that's another thing with the Nordstrom sale is there are a lot of gift with purchases but they're usually pretty brand specific so Moroccan oil is doing a deluxe sample of the frizz shield spray all-in-one leave-in conditioner and night serum with a purchase and they say that this gift is valued at $20 I, I don't know about that because I don't know the cost of these minis, but for a gift with purchase, I would actually really like these and use them, especially when I travel. Now, non-beauty related, but just because I wanna talk about these shoes, I am planning to purchase these shoes from Converse. I love Converse. 
so much. I love Converse and when I see like a cool pair of Converse, I'm like, give those to me. These are high tops and they're regularly $95 or that's the price they're going to be after the sale is over, but they're going to be on sale for $69.99. So I feel like $25 off is a pretty good price point and I think I would use these a lot. So these are in light gold and I just, I need these. I love my Converse. I love this metallic finish on these. I don't have a pair like this. And I just, I, I think I'm going to need these. There are several different Converse that are going to be on like the sale, but these are the ones I think I'm going to buy. I know that's not makeup related, but I had to tell y'all, these look so cute to me. I would love to know if you're planning to shop the Nordstrom sale. I will have everything I talked about linked down below. I hope my video was helpful to you, kind of giving you some reviews on these products. We didn't talk about every single beauty exclusive, so I will definitely link to the beauty exclusive page down below in the description box. And I would love to hear, is there anything that I didn't talk about that you're like, Heather, why didn't you talk about this? Have you never tried it? Let me know, put me on to some good products. Or if there's something that I should definitely avoid that I'm considering buying, let your girl know. I appreciate y'all giving me reviews down in the comments so, so much, but I would love it if you would stick around here at my channel, check out some of my other videos. Let me know what's good. Let me know your thoughts because I love talking about makeup. And if you like my eye look, it is coming soon.